Hello, in this video I'm gonna show you how to scan documents with iPhone 17 camera. To scan documents with your iPhone 17 camera, uh, you should um, you can do it in two different methods. Uh, first, I'll show you the classic method that's been there for like six years, and then I'll show you a new method which um, I think is more convenient. But let's go to notes first because this is the first method. Um, to begin, go into notes, um, then go to um, a new note or into already created note, click on this. Um, paper clip button uh, to to do a attachment and click on scan documents now position the document in front of your camera so I'll ha I'll get just like a manual from a random device I know what the device is here but yeah I have the document as you can see I'm gonna open it and I'm gonna scan it, but there's auto shutter enabled currently, so I'm gonna disable it because I want to talk about the um, app. You can see here it discovers where the document starts, where it ends, and stuff like that. You can do a filter for color, for grayscale, for black and white, and for photo. I'll do the color, and also you can turn on or off the flashlight I'll leave it on auto <coughs> and maybe I'll just scan one page of it because it's harder to do it with two pages I think or maybe not okay I've taken it and now what you can see here is that it shows me the selection of uh, the document right so I can adjust uh, the corners mm, so it later later um, adjust the perspective as good as it can and typically it works just great sometimes you may want to ever so slightly um, fix it so you can do it you can see it displays under my finger um, the magnified version so I can more precisely adjust it now let's keep it and you can see here's my document I'm gonna click on approve but you could have scanned more and you can see now it's added uh, to my notes and, and it's just in notes right but maybe you want to save it as a file I think that's more common and saving as a file um, you could technically save it from 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 here as a file by uh, like I guess clicking somewhere and then save to files and stuff like that but it's not that convenient as just going to preview app and in preview app click on scan documents scan that document that you'd like to scan then um, I'm gonna click on my scan you can see I'm gonna just uh, adjust it because I just wanted one page that's one that's why one of them is covered a little bit mm. so yeah you can adjust it like that but of course you can see it does a pretty good job by do uh, with doing it itself and now it is done I could also add the filters like grayscale or black and white which will improve the contrast or photo I'll do the black and white because you can see I have a greater contrast here mm. and I could also rotate it I could retake it okay I clicked on retake I don't I didn't really want to do that I'm gonna go back I'm gonna approve and now I have it as a scan document so uh, now it's in uh, my files I I believe I'm not really sure let's see yeah it is there so if I went to files or into the preview app I can see it right and um, I hope that the video was helpful don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one